Hey guys, welcome back to the video. Let's continue the Israeli campaign. So there is a new mission ahead of us, artillery attack. I'm supposed to destroy some artillery units uh, because it is firing sporadically across the border at Allied defensive positions. The Allies have used short tracking radar to pinpoint the location of two artillery batteries. You are required to destroy both of them before they inflict further damage. So, uh, okay, there should be some artillery units on waypoint X and waypoint Y, but apparently some of the air defenses may be also in this area, especially this uh, Y waypoint seems to be guarded pretty uh, pretty well so let's take the EZM pot just for some electronic countermeasures definitely will help me a lot and these cluster bombs I will use them against the against these artillery locations and probably on, on the first waypoint and then on the second waypoint I'm gonna use this infrared mavericks so I will be much faster away from this Y waypoint. So let's take off. You are clear for take off. So we are taking off from the Ramat David airport, heading north to waypoint X. Let's see first the air situation. So far so good, but my view range or my radar view range is just 35 miles, so need to see. For example, Waypoint X is currently 30 miles away, so definitely need to look further. And you can see some shell bombardment coming out uh, into our direction probably. Okay, some MiG-21 and MiG-29 appeared in the air already from the Lebanon or Syria border. And there are some explosions on the ground, probably from these artillery units. So far the area appears to be clear. Just one. Okay, the MiG-29 appeared. He was behind the MiG-21, hidden behind it. He's closing to us. So let's take him down. And we are being attacked from the waypoint X somewhere from that location. There was an IR missile flying for flying from there. I'm gonna wait with the launch. Looks like he's maneuvering, so not gonna waste my sidewinder. Okay, now it's time to fire it. Okay, it was a hit. MiG-21. MiG-29, okay, that's the biggest threat for now. And he's also firing at me, as you can see. Easy and fail, okay, so I've been hit. A radar still sees me. Where is the bandit? MiG-27 might be. Oh, there is another. Aircraft very close to me. MiG-21. Okay, shut down.
There is someone flying behind me. And we are being shot also from the ground by some Shilkas. There is someone flying behind me still all the time and firing missiles at me. MiG-27, definitely. Okay. Finally he's down. Like he was behind me all the time. Okay, let's focus on our job now. Our mission. So let's fly to waypoint. X 16 miles ahead let's switch to the ground radar and uh, CBUs and let's see what's there on the ground let's go. some SA9 on the right side and we should be able to see the ground target already is the D30 so that's the primary target for us it's an artillery unit as might seem caution caution okay let's repeat this uh, flight again not flight just just this rate I just wanted to see whether there were like there were like two targets on a on a radar. Okay, there is also a multiple rocket launching system, so still a valid target for us. It's such a modernized version of the obsolete Katyusha system. Another unit there. I'm surprised that this CBUs doesn't take like all of them like Caution. at once. I'm trying to follow the terrain just to mask myself and avoid being hit by this there are still some missiles flying into my direction this is some kind of command uh, caution, command caution. APC which is probably guiding the artillery fire Let's switch to the Mavericks just to see whether. Okay, another gun is still there. That's okay. This this should do the work. No, I missed. I simply missed the. Can you believe that I missed the the thirty? Have it, sir. What target? Okay, mission accomplished, so let's fly home. And I will try to avoid Caution. getting hit by Caution. this SEM site. 
Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Okay, enough fuel. But we are returning to base anyway. Maybe I should drop like two CBUs on the waypoint X and two CBUs on the waypoint Y. It should be, it, or it might be more more effective, and then just to kill the remainings by uh, by Mavericks. I'm a little bit uh, surprised that these CPUs are not as effective as I would expect to be. So. I, I dropped like. 8 CBUs on a very small target, like a uh, small group of targets and uh, they did definitely some work but I would expect it like the the carpet effect to be more more pronounced and the uh, targets will be killed by the first like rate without the necessity to repeat it Okay, so we are on the approach currently to the Rama David Air Base. I'm going to land there very soon. I was just thinking about uh, today about this game that I have an old uh, Windows XP laptop that uh, I should try to run this game there. It's, I have it installed there and it looks like it's running smoothly there, not like this uh, at such speeds like on this PC. And maybe I can do my uh, video recordings there, I don't know. It might be, might be better for me just to fly slower than currently I am. Okay, so let's go. Oh, I, I almost landed on the lights. I'm usually very short in this in this game. I don't know why, but like the speed is reducing somehow faster when I go when I am closer to the to the runway. So okay, so it was a successful mission. Uh, most of the MRS got destroyed and also the artillery. So we destroyed six D30 Havitzers. Some supply pallets got destroyed as well by this CBU bombing. One command APC and two rocket launchers were destroyed as well. One MiG-21, two MiG-29s and one MiG-27. So basically all the sidewinders were successful. And we didn't lost any any target whatsoever during this mission so pretty much that's a success for us let's save the progress and guys there is a last uh, last mission ahead of me battlefield air defense which i will fly or publish uh, publish tomorrow so uh, that's all for today for the f-16 fighting falcon Thank you for watching my videos, thank you for writing me any comments, I really appreciate it. 
it really helps me out you write usually about this game that you know it very well that you like it and uh, you are surprised how this game looks like even though it is so old so basically i have to tell you that it was a pretty amazing game back then when it, when it came out and uh, had like deep simulation of the avionics weapons it's pretty pretty nice it would be much better if I will be able to run it in the correct like play speed, not like such accelerated. You will enjoy it much much better and it will help me maybe to use for example the the gunpot. It was very very uh, successful and very effective and I remember it back then. I was using it in maybe almost all missions against ground target targets and uh, it was pretty devastating like when you shoot at any any ground target with uh, 30 millimeter rounds it's it was a complete destruction and i was able like to dis destroy 10 10 maybe uh, ground targets just with this spot but nowadays i'm not able to aim it because the speed is like very fast and my all my shots are going somewhere like one meter or half meter away from the target so basically it's it's useless now uh as said before thank you for watching this video have fun take care